so what's up guys today we are going to react to Transformers the last night extended super bowl TV spot that's a fucking mouthful <laughs> now, Transformers last night extended super bowl TV spot yeah holy shit I <laughs> <laughs> can't believe I did that with no mistakes <laughs> I'm really bad with tongue twisters and that was good alright so we're gonna keep this wrong because no battery Let's do it. <laughs> you want to know, don't you? Why they keep coming here? Hmm. To Earth. Where are the others? The ones you're hiding. I won't sell out, friends. Yeah, no explosions. Wait, was that good? Was that good? Yeah, a lot of people um, aren't sure what to make of this. Like, I, Optimus Prime is fighting Bumblebee, but why? <laughs> the obviously, something to do with, um, as he said, with his maker. Maybe the, his maker actually corrupted Bumblebee or something to turn on Optimus. No, no, I'd no, say it's Optimus it, that's corrupted. Bro. Yeah, it would be oh, the opposite. Well, I mean, did you see his yeah. eyes go red? Purple? Yeah. Uh, so, uh, this is, either this is a really good marketing ploy to get people thinking, okay, we've got to go and see this, we need to see what the fuck's going on. Yeah. Or, um, oh fuck, what was I going to say? <laughs> this was a clever marketing ploy, or this is just a plan all along. Mm. 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 I still like how they've brought Mark Wahlberg back into it still. Yeah, he said, he, time, yeah, he said he, um, Age of Extinction was going to be final. Now he's saying this is going to be his final. Fucking hope not. He's we'll good see, in this. we'll see. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's quite not. disappointed in the franchise. Yeah. So, um, so it's really up to Mark Wahlberg. I have heaps of respect for him not to do it. Um, and I can see why, but hmm. I don't know, we'll, we'll give this a chance. I mean, I've liked every single one of them. Despite the fact that the probably the last two were unnecessary long, and it did feel a bit dragged out, but it was still good. I like it. I like the franchise. It, you know, I still didn't like the second one, but I did like the others. Yeah, like, I um, didn't mind them. It's just I kind of didn't get into them, but I did. It was like a on-off kind of thing for me. Yeah. I mean, I like Bay's directing style. Except it for suits the intense amount of the explosions. <laughs> <laughs> it suits. I can't imagine anyone else directing. Mm. And if someone else is going to step up, then they need to stick to the way they I mean, Transformers, Transformers is Michael Bay's kind of Film. area. Yeah. Mm. Concerned that that's got a fuck ton of explosions in it anyway. And the yeah. cartoons and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, exactly. Um, but. Yeah, that's, that's all I can think of at the moment. It's Michael Bay's specialty explosions. Yeah. <laughs> um, Megatron is back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like he was revived at the end of the last one. Mm -hmm. First was Galvatron, but then he. So what? Fuck! What happened to him? How did he come back before? I can't remember. Why the fuck? Did I, I mean, just think of Metatron. <laughs> Metatron <laughs> is supernatural. Jesus Christ! It's just, you know, it's a little disappointing that um, the original voice actor for Megatron. What was his name? Mm. He played. He played um, Red Skull. Oh, he's um, V for Vendetta. He's, he, he plays Agent Smith in the. Uh, right. Just it's just one of those names. It's I, there. Yeah. You guys know who I'm talking about. Maybe you guys would be thinking the same thing. Hugo, Hugo Weaving. Weaving. Hugo Weaving. Weaving. That's it. Weaving. Hugo it's Weaving. It's a shame that he's not one to do this. Anymore. He was in the first three, but after that, it's been someone else. Yeah, I think Hugo Weaving did the voice of Megatron. Megatron. Oh, yeah. First yeah, he did the first three. Oh, mm. well, there you go. Yeah. Very talented, too. He's Australian as well. Yeah. Mm. Um, but See, all the good actors come from Australia. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. Seriously. Jackman, Majority of the be world's best actors are from here. Margot Robbie. 
Definitely some bakers yeah, as well. I guess. The minimalist. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, anyway, look. What was I going to say? I was going to say something. Something about Megatron? Uh, yeah, something about the new director. The new director has to stick to, this, this, to the style or people are just not going to mm. like it. In my opinion, if Michael Bay leaves, then I don't know if I want to continue watching it. Yeah, same. Because it's going to be completely different. Yeah. He's directed. I don't think I'm going to be up for that. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he is the Transformers series director. It's like saying... Exactly. He's the one that's, He's been carrying it since 2007. So for the past 10 years, he's been the guy. It's like almost saying like about Ridley Scott with Alien. Exactly. Like exactly. James Cameron's Aliens didn't do as well as what I would have thought. Even though it was good, but it wasn't as good as Ridley Scott. Yeah. I mean, like, Mark, Mark Bay's not really well received, but no. he's. It, this franchise. The, the com- most common but his, problem yeah. is the story. Yeah. Other than that, it's bloody good. Yeah, exactly. You know, like, if they just get the right writers. And they'll be good. They'll be magic. They'll be good. Yeah. Like, uh, that goes for any movie. Mm. Alrighty, so anyway. I guess we should stop talking. And <laughs> <laughs> Go carried away again. Yeah, yeah exactly. And we'll, uh,. Let you just decide the rest and we'll catch this later.